congratulations on the We're going to say, this is my 10 week pregnancy vlog and I have a guest with me today. Yes, glad to be here and congratulations on making it 10 weeks. <laughs> I cannot believe it's been 10 weeks already. And Hard to believe. I'm almost 11 weeks tomorrow the next day. That's why it keeps confusing me on what I should say. This is 10 or 11. We'll say this one is 10, the last one was 9, and then I'll go with my dad say because I am 10 we're weeks. Doing once, we're doing this once a week from here yep. on out? Yeah, I usually do. Oh, wow. So I did with the girls. Am I going to be every week? You don't have to be every week if you want to. I'd love to be every week. <laughs> I got off early today, so yeah, I'd like to be here. So we'll interesting, though, fact, mm -hmm. 10 weeks, did you know that our babies? Like face facial features <laughs> are starting to show, like the nose, cute little button yeah, nose. I can see, see it now. Yeah. So crazy already. And if it's a boy, <laughs> if we don't know, um, yeah. that's when the testes start to <laughs> 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 And the girls' eggs start to form. Yes. So already. I mean, that's hap So we're, basically, the gender is. Um, it's already. Yeah. Known. Yeah. Whatever it is. You so we're just waiting. Yet. Yeah. Interesting though, they can tell, well, they can tell that the the reproductive organs are forming, but they can't tell, they can't tell us if it's a yeah. boy or a girl yet. Right. Uh, how do they At know? least like five more weeks, because we found out with Kinsa it was like 15 weeks, but Claire was 17 weeks. Then how do they it's know? It's usually somewhere between 15 and 20 weeks. They just wait for it to form more so they can tell for sure. They don't tell know. you boy yeah. or girl. Okay. So. I'm just wondering how they came up with that, that's all. What, when to do it? No, 10 weeks. They, that The reproductive organs form, but Science. you can't find out. <laughs> so, I think they just made that but up. also it's getting little uh, fingernails? fingernails already. No way. Yep. Well, is there anything <laughs> like, do you bite your fingernails a lot? Yes, you know that. <laughs> <laughs> if they're anything like Heather, they're biting those fingernails already. Yeah. In the in the womb. I hope the girls don't do that. Kinsley has a song. It's starting to stick yeah. out today when you see my belly. Yep, she's getting a baby bump. Baby bump. So, main thing. Alright, let's get to business. Hold on. Let me fix my pants. Fix your pants. So, <clears throat> I see that you're wearing legging that's more comfortable. Yes, only the leggings this pregnancy. Yeah. I think. All the way through. <laughs> Alright, check on that. Um, are you keeping up with your uh, vitamins and everything? Yes. You sure? Yeah. These right here? Yep. The um, like prenatal vitamins. Smart pants. Smart pants. These gummies. Yeah, see, that's the thing, uh, guys out there um, and girls. I'm a big fan of the the pills that you take, the ones that you can get where it's like the all natural like um, supplements, vitamin, but they're the ones you have to swallow and they're humongous. So, I can't Heather can't do that, and I don't blame her. I don't blame her. Like this is the next, be like the next best thing, yeah. But I have to take six of them a day. Yeah, I tried to tell her if we had the pills, it'd be one. Yeah. Get it all <laughs> one and done. But this is the non GMO um, vitamins, so still, still very good. Yep. But six of them is crazy. I know. And you're taking your uh, omega 3s? Alright, do you know what this helps with, by the way? This is a pop quiz. What? <laughs> you don't know? No. <laughs> you just told me to take it. So. I did. So, number with, well, at, in the office, we always tell the pregnant women there that, you know, your pregnant vitamins, obviously, omega-3s, and this is getting into stuff they don't care about. <laughs> but they're, okay, well... EPA and DHA omega 3s that's mm -hmm. the most important thing mm -hmm. and that helps with the brain activity um, for the baby especially when this when you first find out that you're having the, that's the first thing that forms is you know the brain it's making those synapses those connections and this helps with that so um, awesome. very important Take a note. and this again she can't take pills <laughs> yeah. So I found her some. Take those. Squ yes, the, the squeeze kind. That it's not that bad. No, they have. This is the orange flavor. They have tropical flavor as well. Um, you did you tell them one? already? Yeah, we just got some there. Yeah. Okay. Uh, 
We ordered the tropical flavor on accident, actually. So cool. Yeah. Um, did you like have like a list of the brand and stuff you used? Like below. Yeah, below. In the links. Okay. Yeah. No, I didn't. I mean. Yeah, we'll, we'll do that. Because I'm a big yeah. fan of this, especially again. There's a lot of people out there that can't. Do people take, take it for food. anything else, like? Oh, if you're well, not pregnant. Oh, if you're not pregnant, this is still very good, um, especially for your this, own brain. Well, yeah. <laughs> no, well, omega threes are what's important. The people think just any omega, it's like omega six, that's really not doing you any good. So omega three is the main thing, mm -hmm. and yes, everybody should be taking some. I take some as well. I'm not pregnant, so, <laughs> <laughs> um, but I take the pills in there. But anyway, the fact that this is, instead of a pill, this is the squeeze kind, so it really helps with more absorption. You get it into your system a lot more and a lot quicker, so I'm a big fan of that. And protein. Another thing, too, with the ladies in the office is the omega-3s, prenatal, and protein. So you need to be doing about 100 grams more of protein a day. So, okay. Have you been adding that to your shakes? Even extra than what I normally do? Well, just a hundred, hundred grams. Okay. Okay. All right. Well, I'm writing that down. <laughs> Not so good on hours. How are you doing in the mornings? Better now. I was gonna say that this week. Mm -hmm. I've been feeling better. I've been able to take my shakes and not be like yuck. Yeah. And, but I did get the pregnancy pops. I showed them last week. Never so, heard. Of them. I can show them to you. It's just like a hard piece of candy. What's in them? <laughs> I'm sure they're fine. It's say natural, all okay, natural, all, right, all, right. all that kind of stuff. But that has helped in the mornings. It's like after I take my shake to have one of those. And But it hasn't been that bad as it was. It was oh, easy. it was, it was like bad. Yuck. But now it's better. Okay, good to hear. Good. So cool. This week is a big week for you because you've announced. To everybody, right? Yep, everybody knows. Yeah, you it's out there. Everybody. We told family and friends, and now we told you guys. Mm -hmm. Everybody knows, so it's so crazy. Does that feel good to finally tell everybody? Yeah, it does. Yeah. <laughs> I bet it, oh, it so did for me too. So now I can like talk about it in the vlog and stuff. Now right, we right, can, right. you know, and talk about it. Now we can talk it. about it, and now we can get some support. Yes. <laughs> uh, everybody you guys. Support us. Yeah, like asking so, to help. Because awesome. uh, I found out <laughs> the <laughs> like, two days after Christmas. Yeah. So, wow, after from Christmas. right after Christmas to mid-February, yeah, I've just and been like, like I can't talk about this to anybody I need help. <laughs> <laughs> so <laughs> this is this is good for everybody. And now I'm trying to get up all our videos. Video, the pictures you got developed. Yep. Glad, side note. You, Heather, she talked me into the, um, really didn't have to do a lot of talking, but to the announcement pictures, because we've never yeah. done that before, yeah. uh, like professional. You should <laughs> like do the ones where we tried to do it ourselves, and then the professional, <laughs> yeah. like how different <laughs> they player. were. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> um, it was pretty cool. some of them were similar. Yeah. Well, I mean. What we not, tried to do, yeah, and then tried. that's what we wanted, but then it the didn't professional ones, out. yeah, were yeah. way. Awesome. And I mean, this could be our last one, so. Yep. We gotta do everything Ooh. this time that we wanna do. Ooh. And I think I wanna do attorney pictures this time. Cause I didn't with the girls at all. Picture. I don't know if we do, like, I just do it by myself or we do them as a family. So um, I'd like to get some pictures with y'all too, but I, I think a lot of times you just, just do uh, attorney pictures by yourself. I feel like it's the um, whole well, year. Person that's pregnant, of course, and yeah. the husband. I felt like I don't, I don't know. I don't know. All right, Molly, got to go. One thing I wanted to tell you guys what Kimberly said that one time about. She's been saying she, a lot of stuff. I this know. Time. She's been so cute. I'm really excited to experience this with her because she like wants to rub on my belly already and feel baby, and I'm like, not quite yet. It's not, not there yet for all of that. She's like ready to experience all that with me this time oh, she yeah. knows what's going on like Claire still doesn't know really what's going on and Kinsley didn't either when she was little but now Kinsley knows there's a baby coming and oh, yeah so I don't know what what's kind of which one she's about to say what's coming but there's been some doozies 
<laughs> like, no. oh, it's so funny. I know. She's been getting it uh, more involved for sure. Yeah. Very protective already. Yeah. I feel like. Yeah, she wants me to eat carrots if she eats carrots. Yes. Um, drink good stuff. No, uh, she's been on the sweet tea. She's like, yeah. no sugar. Yeah. All right. Drink more water. So stuff but like that. It's really cool. You know, I know. This is what I write down about. So we didn't get this on camera, did we? No, we didn't get this one on camera. We just, I want to remember to tell you guys what she said about just with trying to be healthier that I don't need to eat candy because the baby will get cavities. And she said, but if you do, you need it. The baby needs a toothbrush to brush his teeth. <laughs> oh, yeah. <I'm laughs> like she doesn't need Were y'all brushing a toothbrush teeth yet. Then so. or something? Um, in the bathroom? I think so. We were talking about candy, not eating. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or being healthy. And well, it was so funny. She was like, but the baby needs a toothbrush. Yep. How's it gonna get a toothbrush? Yep. <laughs> like, I'm gonna swallow a toothbrush. You gotta give that toothbrush. <laughs> yeah. Baby's teeth are gonna be clean. If she eats sugar, baby gets sugar. Right. So, so and baby's gonna get sugar, but yeah, get the cavities. Okay. And there's been a lot of them, though. It's so cool. I know. It's so, but now I can vlog it whenever she says oh, yeah. funny things like that. We'll get it on film. Just gotta soak it up. Yep. Thing. Any concerns right now you're 10 weeks so any concerns going on right now and i'm trying to like do this as a uh, <coughs> patient like i, I just think, got off <laughs> i think the kids would have lots of questions i can't wait for her to go back to the doctor when i get a little bit further along yeah. but and i do go let's see not this monday but next monday so in about a week i'll be getting back to the doctor and i think they'll be able to hear the heartbeat then I really like to hear the heartbeat because you don't do that when you go to the first appointment ultrasound. You just see the baby and she told me it was like, what was it, 140? 145? Uh, well, that was kind of low. 150. But she off. said it would get higher. Mm -hmm. Because I think we'll hear the heartbeat then and just like a checkup. And then I don't well, know. Well, we're only I having think one the more next ultrasound one, though. Right, to find out the gender. Yeah. But yeah, I think the next one will be the gender one. Right I am kind of leaning towards waiting until the big day. To find out. <laughs> I am. Well, yeah, right. You wanted to find out at the ultrasound. You didn't even want to wait. I did. Until we did a gender reveal. I know. I wanted to wait. I mean, I wanted to find out as soon as it's the possible. nurse did. Um, but I had a patient this week. He was very convincing. <laughs> about waiting to find out so yeah I don't know you have a sparkle on your neck. I had a sparkle <laughs> on my neck the other day <laughs> what so, in the world it is like right there I think I got it right there it really? look it's like oh that is very small <laughs> <laughs> it's like sparkling on your lip How so that? anyways and I do want to do a gender reveal I just don't know exactly how I want to do that yet just give us some ideas below gender reveal stuff I've got it out here. Post it on. Tell us any names you like. Cause names. We're going to be thinking about names soon. I haven't we thought about much. names yet. Yeah. Out by girl. I have no idea. Yeah, I don't know. So, and even a boy would probably rethink that. I mean, it feels yeah, it, positively. So, we'll see. And, so yeah. yeah. So now you want to wait? I don't know. It's just, <laughs> I'm being conflicted. See how you feel when... I don't think I think you avoided my question. So, was uh -huh. there any concern? Like, you're at ten weeks. Are you concerned about anything? You're everything good? Everything's going good. Um, yep. This is the third time around, so I'm pretty much like everything's routine now. Okay. I kind of know like. Is, is your next. husband helping you out enough? Is what I'm saying. I mean. Yeah. Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> he could do we need a to clean better. up around this house. I need to get that done. <laughs> paper, scissors, and spot that. Who's it going to be? They're really curious, though, like, for any of the bigger house, which we talked about it in the vlog a little bit. I but, haven't really fully expressed that, though. Yeah. I think we just need to get rid of stuff, and we'd be fine. We have so much stuff. I think we're fine. We live fine. in this society that just more stuff, more stuff, more stuff, and they don't play with it, but for, like, a day... And but then, if we could get our room fixed up out there, that'll just solve everything. Some of these toys will be going out there, like bigger things that are just like yeah. taking up too much room. Matter of fact, but we should just donate. Uh, I mean, we donate to like Habitat for Humanity or something. But we, we just donate to the people. <laughs> hey, y'all want some toys? 
Yeah. Looks good about here. I, that is but, one of the biggest problems, I think, not only for us, but for a lot of people. Yeah. And I need need help getting rid of the stuff. You don't think we need to get rid of the stuff? Yeah, oh, okay. obviously, definitely. And then we that would have more room. Uh, yeah, and I'm fine with that right now, but I think when the girls get older, like teenage years, they'll want their own rooms. Yeah, because obviously, so, have you told them, like, they're going to be sharing rooms? Yeah, I mean, if we're staying here, obviously. Yeah. <laughs> they're going to um, share. They're excited to share a room right now. They're little. They want to sleep together, sleep in the same room. But, but I'm concerned. I'm, it's going to be because Claire sleeps a longer time. Yeah. When I have to get Kinsley up for up. school, um, I'll be waking up them both. I don't know. Yeah, that'll be, be hard. Yeah. We'll, we'll figure She's it out. She's a hard sleeper, though, okay. so I don't know. Okay. Anyways, that'll just make me get up earlier and get my day started. Yes, happens. I like that. But, yeah, so then the other room we'll have um, for the baby. So Claire's room probably pretty much stay the same, depending on yeah, the square the girl. Room. Yes. And then, but I'm fine with staying smaller, like smaller house. It's just, I know when I was a teenager and was older, I'm glad I had my own room. So I would like to have give them the, their own room. Same. I agree with that. But and then we'll be downsizing again when they get even older. Right. <laughs> it would be a yeah exactly. So so we'll see. But we'll I was see. wanting to look up. But I but I don't want to. <laughs> I want to get stuff out here. Get yeah, again. I think it's gonna be near my birthday, like the first week of April. April so I don't know if it'll be the next. Yeah, it pro I don't know if it'll be that next appointment or the next one. When we find out the gender, or if we do, we'll have to find out. How's okay. exercise going for you during? Good. I'm still exercising. I'm still doing about the same. I'm trying to do more cardio than weights, and I'm not doing any extra weights. I'm doing the same weights or less, because I am feeling like I'm a little bit more tired when I do my normal weights. So, mm -hmm. I have went down some, and so I feel safer that way. And then... I'm just trying to run more than I normally would. Just a little bit more. I've noticed so. one of the biggest things for me, I've noticed that you're more tired this pregnancy. Yeah. Well, like, really you do have two other kids. Yeah. And this pregnancy. A lot. But we've been trying to get bed earlier. So. But that's what I'm saying. That's how I noticed that we go to bed so much earlier. Yeah. <laughs> and I'm so thankful for that because I try to get up yeah. at five every day and just crazy. get my morning started. Call it the perfect start so I can just. Just like it like Jesus. that. Yeah, because yeah. like yeah. read, like that read my Bible, read a book I'm reading right now, do some journaling. I can do all that before, you know, madness like starts. Day. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> but it also makes it, yeah, it just puts me in the right mindset. So I call yeah. that the perfect start. If I can do that, it would be better. So getting to sleep early is yeah. key for that to happen. And yeah. now that she's wanting to go to bed earlier, that helps out. <laughs> yeah. Because it's tough. It's like with kids but, in the bed, that's the only time we have a little Yeah, like we like to watch shows on Netflix and stuff and now we try to just watch one and go to sleep or just you know, like go in and go to sleep. Because so. it's not good to watch shows or earlier. in the bed. Yeah. <laughs> At all. <No. laughs> Anything else because we need to take measurement of my belly and I'm sure this vlog is getting really long now. And you're... Yeah. I don't know if they heard that. She just her <laughs> stomach just growled. I know, I'm hungry. Okay. And it's only eleven something. No, it is almost. I didn't realize we had a time limit on this thing. I apologize. No, we don't. Uh, but let us. Take me longer to edit, but that's okay. Yeah, some of that stuff I was talking about is not that important. Okay, so we have got to um, do a belly measurement. Yep, be on bed. Do I need to guess? Belly. And then maybe we'll take a picture. I haven't really taken any pictures, so I haven't like, um, posted a. Baby do you do centimeters or inches? Inches. I'm saying. Yeah. What do you think? Twenty-six. That's where I like started. <laughs> so. You didn't let me finish. Twenty-six and a half. <laughs> Twenty-six and a half. But right at your belly button, correct? Yeah. To keep. Okay. I do it a little bit lower. What? Well, lower it. Really? Yeah, because that's where my belly sticks out. Really. <sighs> Yes. You gotta lift up your shirt, don't you? Yep. <laughs> I've got a bigger shirt on today. And my leggings can do that. Here. So you do go below it? I think you should go I do. Look at my little hairs. Stop. 
starting to stick out now a little bit. Mm -hmm. Is it that way? Yep. <laughs> oh, ho, ho. What? It is about 30. Yep. It's pretty shitty. 30 and a quarter? 30 and a half. 30 and a quarter. Okay. Yeah. Give me that it's quarter. A little bit bigger. Yeah. I was a little off. It's getting out there. Yeah. I'm not going to turn this again now. I'll let it down. Yeah. And that's before you eat. That's the third and a quarter. <laughs> It'd be way bigger but after I eat. Yeah. And I do get like bloated at night, I feel like. I feel like really sick. Oh, that's what I should have asked about. What? So how bloated do you get? <laughs> that's a good Just a question. little bit. Is that good? I don't know. I can't tell it with my hand. It's so stupid. <laughs> we'll feel it though. Oh, boy. Boy. <laughs> boy. <laughs> It's in there, whatever it is. All right, you just I Thanks, guys, so much for watching. Yes. I'm glad Babe was here today. And maybe he'll be in some more pregnancy vlogs with me because that was fun. It was fun. Special was guest. Fun. That, that sounded really <laughs> <Yeah>. important. <laughs> Not and so much. thanks for watching. Subscribe, comment, like. Check out our daily vlogs. And we'll see you guys soon. Let us know if you have any video requests or anything like that or below. questions I could ask because I... Yeah. I really didn't, or have, any questions for I really didn't have any questions to ask. I was just doodling. Um, and then he can answer them next time or whatever. I or if you have any him. questions for us, we can answer Yeah, I'll ask her on next week, on week 11 of yep. Pregnancy Update. Yay! Is that what you're calling? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I don't know yet what, I don't know exactly. I haven't started uploading yet, so I need to though. Like, I'm trying to get up the took my pregnancy test, surprising you, like all that kind of stuff, and then I'll start the pregnancy vlog. So, I need to get it there. So, yeah, so it'll be up soon. By the time you see this, though, they'll already be going. So, anyways, then we'll be back on track soon. All right, see y'all later.